So everyone is looking forward to Android 15 based custom rooms and Android 14 is quite stable. You already know that. But in case you don't know, some of the custom rooms are even updating with Android 13 and CR Droid is one of them. What do you mean by updating? As you can see, this is the August security patch, which is not too old, of course, and it could be device specific for some of the devices. They also got the latest security patch based on Android 13. So it's just for you to, to see how Android 13 is performing in the terms of Android 15, basically, because Android 15 is just around the corner. CR Droid is also giving you Android 15 very soon. But in case you don't know CR Droid, Android 13 has a lot of features, some amazing things which even Android 14 did not have. And of course, Android 15 might not have too. Which are those features, amazing things which you have in this one? Let's find out all those things in this video. Make sure to watch this video till the end. Here you have one of my favorite features. This is called Parallel Space. This is unfortunately not present with Android 14. It's available with some of the Android 14 based custom rooms. As far as I know, Dubfest OS is one of them. But CR Droid was giving you App Cloner. App Cloner and Parallel Space are two different things. App Cloner lets you clone some apps only one time, but Parallel Space has option to use these apps multiple times. For example, as far as I know, you can create up to five instances of any Android app and this looks so good. This is one of my favorite features ever and unfortunately it's not present with Android 15 although we have the and sorry Android 14 although we have the private space option available with Android 15 and that is one of the most exciting features. Secondly, this Google services option. I just can't remember this feature. It, it's just not present with Android 14 anymore. What, it, what this feature does is you can disable the Google Play services even after installing them. So in case you want to use a D Google device, you can disable this toggle and all the Google Play services will be disabled. This is a very amazing feature and unfortunately not present with Android 14 at all. Another thing is, if we move on to the security options, App Lock. Yes, it's also present with some of, some of the Android 14 based custom rooms already. The good thing is, App Lock was so consistent with Android 13. And of course, in case Android 13 is available for your device, you have to look it out for sure because yes, it's updated with the latest security patch and all the amazing features are already present in this case. You can also use the hiding gaps feature, which is a very useful thing, of course. Including this one, it already brings you all the miscellaneous spoofing options like this Google Play Integrity Spoof, which was also added with the latest CR Android version based on Android 14. It's already present with CR Android Android 13 too. You already have this Google Services and Parallel Space option, which is unfortunately not a part of Android 14 anymore. Although three finger screenshot option is there, we do not have the option to customize the three finger swipe gesture, but that's completely okay. We already have the Game Space option and the Netflix spoofing and all the Google spoofing options. One another major difference which I found here is the reticker notifications. We have the Dynamic Island style notifications with Android 14 based custom rooms, but reticker notifications and Dynamic Island notifications are a little bit different in case you have used both of them. You already got to know reticker notifications were just so amazing. One more thing is if you move on to the miscellaneous header images, you have the option to customize it. Yes, you already have these options with Android 14. But with Android 13, this is the UI. I mean, you have the option to choose this 24 styles of header images and a bit of UI changes in other words, or the option how to select these kind of things. Although options are already present with Android 14 too. But yes, in case you are wondering about Android 13, if you want to try it out, this feature is present here in this case too. And we already have the option to customize the rows and columns. So you can make it look like Android 11 style too, in case you want to. Also, the lock screen clock fonts are also present. It doesn't bring you Android 14 style clocks, of course, like you have in Android 14 by default, but this is not bad at all. You already have the lock screen clock fonts and there are many options to choose from. You can choose any one of these things and these look so good, definitely. I mean, yes, it's not as much as, I mean, these are not stock like Android 14, but this is not as bad as you are looking forward to. So yes, this is it. These are the things available well, in this case, CR Droid. So yes, you also have the CR Droid launcher, which is basically named as Quick Step Launcher. And yes, all the features which were kind of expected are similar in this case. By the way, back gesture is not like Android 14. This was changed with Android 14. Else, we have similar kind of things. It also supports OTA updates. So yes, you can take it, take a look in case you want to. 
these were the things i just wanted to let you know i hope you like this thing if you want to try this out link is already there in the description and this is it thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one make sure to like this video thanks for watching